What's going on guys? Dre here and today we're gonna be striking it rich hopefully in Gold Rush the game now Remember a couple months ago we checked out the demo for this game. It was pretty fun We learned a lot about how gold mining works and I'm assuming we're gonna hopefully learn more today Now they actually branded the game around discovery now if you don't know there's a reality show called gold rush I believe Alaska on discovery and uh yeah, they kind of branded this game around it. It's still a gold mining simulator through and through, though. So we're gonna start up today a new season, and uh, yeah, see how we can do gold mining. It should be fun. All right, and here we are in Haines, Alaska, gold mining capital of the world. Now, it's literally just dropped me off here. I don't have anything to do, so I think it's gonna be one of those simulator games where you kind of gotta figure out everything for yourself. I'm all down for that, though. We did play the demo, so at least I got that going for us. I remember this truck, the good old army truck here, where we can load up anything we want into it. So, let's get inside this thing, and I guess we'll take a drive into Haines. Actually, is there a map? Uh, yeah, we should probably figure out that first. So, yeah, we got a map of good old Haines. Looks like... Yeah, okay, this is, <laughs> this is going to be a lot of work to learn how to play, but you know what? That's what's so fun about simulator games. You should, uh, disable the differential lock. Okay, so let me see the controls here. Differential. There it is. Okay. Uh, wouldn't that mean it's on? I honestly don't know. Okay, so we're gonna keep it like that. Okay, now, now, no, now, now it's telling me to turn it off. Well, make up your mind, game! Alright, let's turn this thing on. Oh, yeah, listen to that puppy kind of purr. Alright, I think... Oh, definitely have the, uh, parking brake on. And it's still telling me the differential lock, so I think it is actually like that. All right, we're good. Nope, nope, it's still tell. Okay, what? What do you want from me? Do you want it down there? Is this is this good enough for you, game? All right, it stopped yelling at me, so we're good. All right, welcome to Haines, Alaska, guys. It's a it's a beautiful place here. But by, by, by the way, this is a gold mining game, so we should probably do a little bit of that. So we got a bank here. What else do we got? The warehouse, the blacksmith, the machine park. And, of course, the gas station. So those are our main places to go. Let's start off by going to the bank. Because if you look at the top right, I got a grand total of 224 buckaronis right now. Probably need a little bit more than that. I don't know. Maybe, maybe we can get a loan in here or something. It's, it's usually a good place to start when you're starting out a simulation game. So, looks like uh, you might need to power wash this a little bit, guys. It's, it's not, 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 not the most inviting of banks. All right. Old Glen Bank. Uh, we can get an old Arnor Ar Arnold parcel, River Town, Pine Valley. So this is to buy them, though. I'm assuming, judging by the price, is, is that to rent them? I mean, you know what? That probably makes sense to rent. We can get a loan in here. We can. Oh my God, this is so cool. We can run the gold stock market, and then of course we can sell our gold bars later on. But I only got 0.35 ounces of gold right now. Not sure where I found that, by the way. Was it in my pocket or something? I have no idea. All right, there is a journal in here, so we should probably, yes, do this. All right, gold mining process brochure. You can buy these? It's just a step-by-step -step list on how to mine gold. I love it. Okay, go to the bank is step one, so we're, we're doing it right already. Rent old Arnold's parcel claim. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll go do that, and then we need to go to the warehouse. All right, simple enough. So let's go rent that thing. Old parcel, we need to rent. My, by how? I don't have enough money. Do I have enough money? I don't... Okay, it's rented. Good enough for me. I still have 223 bucks. I guess in this game you can rent things for free. If, if only real life was like that, right? All right, so now we need to go to the warehouse, which I believe... What the heck? Oh, man. Okay, we're, we're, we're tripping over a curb that doesn't even exist, guys. I think that's literally right here. Let's just try and go over and see. Maybe I'm wrong here. Okay, definitely wrong. A little bit down the street. Let's, uh... Let's not try and break into someone's place. You know, we're, we're, we're new in town. In these small towns, everybody talks about everybody. We, we, we don't want to get on people's bad side. So, oh god, what do you want now? Okay, differential lock. What do you want about the differential lock? I, I It's turned off right now. So, I don't know why it warns me when it's turned off, but thanks, game. All right, starting off strong, though, in this gold mining game. All right, so it looks like the entrance is, yep, pretty much right here. Definitely looks like a warehouse. I mean, there's stuff everywhere. Oh, 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 e, e break, e break. Oh, God. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> We're okay. We did not crash it yet. All right, so let's see what we need here. If we go back to our handy dandy journal, we need to buy a hog pan, no pump, okay, a hog pan sluice box, core, and two hog pan maps 
in one bucket. Sounds simple enough, we just gotta go in here and buy everything that says hog. So check out this though. So this is basically the gold equivalent of a Walmart here. We got everything. If you need a rope, it's right there. You need a hammer? We're, we're good. It's right there. But no, seriously. Okay, so we, I know we need a bucket. 20 bucks? All right. Man, that's an expensive bucket. I think you can get those for like five bucks at Canadian Tire, can't you? All right, but I think we need a good bucket. So I said we needed one of those. I know that at least. And we don't need batteries. Wave table jets. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, fire extinguisher. Might want to buy those. Uh, how much do they... Okay, it doesn't have a price, so we're, we'll never know. All right, this is what I want. Okay, never mind. I, I have $224. Do you want to take that for it? I mean... Is haggling allowed here? I don't think that would work, though. Uh, but yeah, we got all this cool machinery we can one day buy and be a real gold miner. Is these trailers we can buy? Oh, that's cool. So we can attach those to our truck. This is gonna be fun, I think. What the heck is that? Is there a guy? Oh, yeah. Look at... Look at Steve... Steven Batty. Heavy equipment specialist. That... That... That, that is a guy I would trust. Okay, so where, where... Where's the hog stuff? Is this... Oh, yeah, there we go. It said no pump, right? So we just need the sluice box. It said hog pan, no pump. Oh, we actually do need that. Okay, so I quickly checked just in case. So we need one of those. I'm gonna add that. We need one of these. And then I think all we need is some mats. Where are these mats over here? Yes, they are. And I think we needed two of those, hopefully. All right. Uh, where do I cash out? Do it. It didn't use my money. Oh, okay, yeah. Prob probably at the cash register. That would make sense. Uh, so you just want me to use it? Man, in Alaska, they're pretty trustworthy. All right, so we're gonna buy all this stuff. That's gonna cost us 170 bucks. We got 54 bucks to our name. You'll find your order stuff just outside the shop in the designated area. This area has limited storage space, so make sure you clean it before making a big order. <laughs> I kind of want to make a big order before not cleaning it, to, cleaning it to see what happens. All right, so somewhere out here, I should, probably should have turned off my car because there is uh, gas in this. So let's just turn that off real quick here. Maybe I should have pulled it up. I don't know. Is it right here? No, it's right over here. All right, so yeah, let's definitely pull up the truck. And we are ready to get going. So I love how they just throw my stuff. Like, it looks like they literally throwed it everywhere. Can't, can't, can't appreciate a good customer, can ya? All right, so you know what? Maybe we should just jump up. We'll get inside because I don't want to lose these things. Oh, come on, trunk. There we go. That's a real man's jump. So we got that in there. Let's make sure we get everything here. So we got our sluice box. What does it say on the back? Was, was that a brand? Aha, golden retriever, get it? Because it retrieves gold, that's great. Okay, so, got, gotta love a good old comedy routine. All right, so we got this. I'm, I'm, I'm worried we're definitely gonna lose something by the time we make it there. There we go. That looks good to me, that should hopefully stay. Let's close that and make sure it's nice and locked. And we are ready to go, guys. Let's go gold mining. All right, before we get out of this here town, I wanna, uh, Quickly stop at the gas station, which should be up here. Check out the rest of this town, too, because it looks pretty nice around here. All right, yep, there's the gas station. So we got about half a tank, it looks like, judging by my gauge. But who knows if that's accurate or not. So I just want to see if I can get some gas real quick. Uh, I should probably turn off the engine. You know, don't, don't want to explode myself. Put on the parking brake. And is it this even possible to get? Oh, my God. Do I have to actually... This is so cool! Where's the... Uh... Okay, there's the pump right here. Dude, gotta appreciate this when you actually have to put your gas in. And you actually have to choose the amount of gallons you want. So, can we just get... Uh, well, I don't actually have that much money, do I? So let's get... I, it needs about half a tank, so I'm assuming half of this should be good. So, there we go. I guess we're done. That, that was quick. And we're done. Can I go get a pack of chips or something? No, it actually looks closed. So, I don't know how this is working. And that police car, man... This whole place, it looks so run down, it almost looks like a zombie town. Alright, so we're good to go now. Let's actually open up the map and look around and see where we can, uh, go. Because somewhere on here should be our rental thing. Was it Arnold Mine? Old Arnold Parcel, was that it? Uh, rent Old Arnold Parcel's claim. So yes, we have to go over here, uh, to start mining. What's the easiest way to get there? There's a little, uh, cutoff road. Way in the distance, so we need to go down this road into this factory, and then we can get over there. So we do have a little bit of ways to go. All right, back into town, and I believe we have to. 
Oh god, is this a road? Well, the police station's here, so clearly this is a road. Welcome to Alaska, guys. This is the way she goes. That's the excavator place. Alright, so I know I'm going the right way. Somewhere down here, well, we have a long ways to go before we make it to it, but let's not go too fast. If you look at my front hood, it's actually not even connected, so this thing has seen better days, that's for sure. Alright, but we made it to the factory. Not really sure what we do at this factory, but we have to just make our way through this. So, hey guys, how you doing in here? I hope I don't hit anything. And then somewhere over here, on the parking lot, we actually need to go to the next part. So let's actually look at the map real quick. See where we need to go. So yeah, there's a road. It should be right ahead of us, actually, somewhere. Uh, is this considered... Okay, there's probably just this... Yeah, this is just a little road right here. I mean, road's hard to call it, but it's definitely the way we need to go. So we're literally in the middle of Alaska right now, ladies and gents, trying to get to this place. Okay, is this... Man, I don't know where I'm going. I'm new here. I'm gonna go this way. All right, we got some water. We got a tent and a trailer. And yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the location. So let's uh, park this thing real quick. Turn it off so we don't waste that gas. And check out our location, guys. It's beautiful. All right, technically it's a little bit further down, but let's go back to the journal and see what we have to do now. We loaded up the pickup truck, go to the claim, set up hog pan, use a shovel to fill hog pan with dirt, Use a shovel? You didn't tell me to buy a shovel. I hope we have one around here. Rinse the mats in the bucket and start panning. All right, it's as simple as that, guys. And then we can go on to tier two, uh, which is gonna get into the fun stuff. We probably won't be able to do that today, but somewhere, I'm hoping somewhere around here, there should be a shovel. All right, so I went to uh, the dig tube. There's a dig tube, uh, but with a bunch of tutorials in case you ever get lost. So gotta appreciate that in a game like this, though. A lot of games just kind of leave you hanging. Oh, gotta turn that off. Let's not, let's not forget not to waste gas. But now I know where we need to go. There's a specific spot over by the water, which makes sense. You need water to get gold out of it. So we're gonna go get the, uh, if I can jump up here, get this thing. And uh, yeah, we're gonna have some nice scenery today because we gotta go right by this waterfall. Somewhere down here, I think actually right, yeah, I can see it right in front of me. We just gotta put this on here like so. So we're gonna use the uh, water. We're actually gonna pan for gold today. You know, the old school way. Going to a river and just hoping for the best. Mind you, we're still using dirt, so I guess it's not technically the old school way. Gotta get the old golden retriever out. I love the name of this thing, by the way. Uh, we're gonna put that back on the end here. There we go, that's where you put the dirt. Dirt goes down this. The mats catch the gold or the heavy particles and then you sift through those. That's how gold mining works, at least this part of gold mining. All right, bring him a bucket over. There we go. And finally, we just need that one mat. So, uh, uh, excuse me? Where? Hold on here. Did it fall underneath a truck or something? Where'd my mat go? I might need to go back to get a damn mat. I mean, I guess I could do this with one mat. I have no idea. Oh, uh, why am I? What am I doing? Okay, actually, perfect. There we go. Just got to grab this mat. After this, we'll... Deal with the truck. It looks fine over there. It, it, it did good. But I do want to turn that off now. I wonder if I can double the size of this and get more of a yield. Actually, yes, you can, because judging by the fact that we have three and four, we can expand this out. So we might want to upgrade this before we go to tier two mining, which we will do probably in the next episode. All right, let's turn this thing off. Let's just pull it up. May as well. There we go. Park the e-brake. Turn it off this time. And now we get to the fun part of hopefully mining for gold. As soon as, as soon as I figure out, how do I get to my controls? Previous tool, next tool. Is that the arrow keys or is that? Oh, that's a, that's a confusing button. So the comma and the period turn your tool. So we do have a flashlight too. We have a headlamp and a flashlight. That's commitment. And we also got, oh yeah, there we go. We got our shovel if we can. Okay, this is this is not how shovels work game. I wonder if I have to go over to my site. No, is there this looks better the, Oh, there we go. That's the dirt the brown stuff over. Here's the good stuff. So what do I do? Okay, just put it in Oh, Did I miss? <laughs> okay, well first time gold mining. I'm definitely a greenhorn here guys. Oh wait Do I put it in the bucket? Wait, I guess you can do either but let's uh Let's use it on the bucket here, maybe. I don't know. And then do we put... Yeah, you can do it that way. That actually... How much did that give us? 4%. Okay. I actually would just rather use the shovel. I think you can. So let's try that again. All right. Dig a little bit more. I love how it actually moves the ground as well. So you can run out of supplies. Do I just use... 
Oh, man, no, I'm screwing it up. Oh, 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 okay, so you can use it there, and that buffed it to 14%, so it's definitely better to not use the bucket. I've gotten the hang of it now. You have to actually figure out where to use the use key, so... All right, hopefully this this dirt over here is the good stuff, because uh, we're going to try here. We're at 34%. Obviously, we're going to have to use quite a few loads here. All right, and I think I know how to do it now, so uh, we got the dirt. We're at 100%. Everything's good. We need to get some water, obviously, to get some things moving, so that's what I figured we needed to do. But just to be ch safe, I uh, looked at the uh, dig tube, as they call it, which is always obviously very useful. So now... We're going to uh, start making the dirt go down. Look at that. That is so cool. So, again, how this works, the heavy stuff will get stuck in the mats down below. You can actually see they're a little bit dirty now. And uh, that's where, obviously, the gold will go because that's nice and heavy, too. Now, they're actually only at 2%, so we got a lot more we can do right now. Actually, oh, there's actually even more dirt in there. So, this is going to take a while. we got to do quite a few of these loads before those mats fill up with a bunch of good stuff. And, uh, yeah, this is the old manual labor way. I love this. Got to move the water by, by yourself. I believe you can buy a pump upgrade for this, by the way. So we might do that later on. But right now, as you can see, oh, yeah, water's going through. We're at 4% on those things. So this is this, this, this is what I got to do for a while. And, of course, after a while, you run out of dirt, and you got to put some more in this. What are we at? 20%. So it is 10% per shovel load. So I'm just going to get this closest stuff here. And, uh, yeah, fill it up once again. One thing I still need to find is my panner. So when these things are filled, I don't really know where my gold planet panning thing is. I might need to go find that. It's not on my tool list, so I thought it would be. Oh! Okay, so I was getting worried. I was like, where's my gold panning? Dude, we got a whole setup in here that I didn't even notice. So this tent is legit right now. Mind you, all we have in here is our gold pan, so we'll get that stuff later on. I just wanted to make sure that we did have it. This is... They, they upgraded this game quite a bit, so this is gonna take me a while. We're at 11% right now. You can see I'm digging my hole here. Slow and steady, though. Gold's not gonna come quickly. That's kind of the point of gold. If it was easy, it wouldn't be an expensive commodity. All right, a little bit of an update I've been uh, digging, as you can see. It actually takes a lot of dirt to fill up those pads. So what I think I'm gonna do, I know you can upgrade this to a pump, so I, I don't think I'm gonna fill up these pads. I'm hoping, I have no idea how much gold we have right now, but I'm hoping we have enough money to buy that pump. That way I don't have to at least deal with the water. I can see why this would be so annoying. Manually having to do the water as well as the dirt is not the easiest thing. So, for example, that whole load, 10 swipes, gave us 3% more gold. Or not even 3% more gold, 3% more of our mat filled. So we got a 44% mat right now. I think we're going to end that there. <laughs> you can see, uh, yeah, I have dug out quite a bit. That's actually really fun to watch, though. Kind of seeing how much dirt it needs to take to get just a little bit of gold. All right, so let's go over and get my pan. And, uh, yeah, just see how much we have right now and see if we can possibly sell that for anything. So I don't think, maybe I can actually, if I drop that in there, can I pick up, yeah, oh, 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 yeah, look at that, two trips for one. All right, let's just, oh god, okay, maybe I shouldn't run, that wouldn't be the smartest thing right now, this thing's bouncing all over the place. But we do got our pan over here, so if I do remember correctly, we've done this before in this game, by the way. Uh, we're gonna put our pan over there, we're gonna get some water, I think we gotta fill this thing up at least first, so... Actually, maybe we just bring this in the water to fill it up. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so I don't know how I'm holding that. That's, that's got to be pretty damn heavy. So, what we got to do now is... Well, we got a, bu a bucket of water. I think that's all we need. Now we put this... Yes, inside there. Ring it all out. Oh, God, please be lots of gold. Be lots of delicious gold. And we'll do the same... Oh, oh God, don't, don't... Oh, God! Oh! Don't want to lose any of my gold. Okay, maybe I can only do one at a time. That makes sense. So, if we put this in here, like so, there we go. That's all the good stuff. That's all the dirt that came out of that pad. So, now we do this. Now, it's been a while since I've done this, so bear with me here. This is going to be fun. Let's just get a little bit of water and start shaking. There's a nugget. We see one. That's actually a really big nugget already. And I don't remember if I'm supposed to get all the dirt out of here. It's been a while, guys, so bear with me here. <gasps> what? No! What the heck? What? I, I just... 
It just reset. No, don't do this to me. I need this gold. There, it's down. It's gone. It, it's totally gone. You have got to be kidding me! I worked so hard for that, only for me to ac accidentally hit escape because I wanted to actually go back and just make sure I'm doing it right. Uh, gold panning controls. Great. All right, let's exit the panning mode. That was a complete failure. So what I wanted to do, I just did it again, is go to the dig tube just to see if I'm doing it right. All right, well, that is a huge bummer. We still have more dirt in here, though. Thankfully, we get multiple dirts. So we might not have lost as much as I expected. I do think I know how to use it now. So you just want to get this nice and filled with water and do exactly what we were doing. Oh, 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 God. Oh, my. Oh, God. No! No! <laughs> Okay, pick up. It's okay. It's okay. Just gotta, just gotta pick it up and... Oh my god. Okay, I don't know what the heck just happened there. Alright, this is a little bit... My, my whole pan sideways. So let's bring this back. Thankfully... Can I get some water, please? Oh my god. That is... That is just ridiculous. Before we screw up anything else, I see lots of gold in here, so that's good. We should be able to pick this stuff out. Okay, so I think I washed this out enough. We are going to... Pick out the gold nuggets now. Oh, man, you got to be very specific. There we go. Pick it up. There we go. We sucked it right in there. These are just little ones. We don't need the tweezers for them. But at least we finally got some gold. So we will close that. Let's just make sure there's no more gold in here. Mind you, I highly doubt there is, but you never know. There we go. I'm getting the hang of it now. Had a few uh, malfunctions there on my... On probably mostly my behalf, but uh, yeah, that's just all dirt now, so we can get rid of that. No good to me, and let's actually fix this thing, because it's all screwed up. Alright, so we're all set up again, hopefully mostly on flat ground. We still got some water, or dirt in here, rather. It looks like we get four uh, pans per bucket, which is actually way better than what I remember in this game. I think you only got one before, so we're going to earn a little bit more gold this time. Uh, you can see our gold at the top. We did up our gold a little bit. There we go. There's the nuggets that we need. Uh, just get some water out of here. There we go. So it looks like you get about two nuggets per with the 40% uh, that we did, which isn't bad at all. So, all right. That should be good. Pick those up. And we might hit an ounce of gold here, guys. Look at that. All right. We just got to... Oh, I think we're going to have to move this around a little bit. There we go. Grab that one, and we are... Oh, no, we're not at an ounce of gold. We're at 0 0.1 of an ounce of gold. Kind of read that a little bit wrong there. <laughs> Hopefully, we get a huge nugget here, so that's just crap. We'll drop this off. I think that should be it for this bucket. No, we have one more. That's right. And then we have one more mat to do after that, so we should be good. The other mat is... Yeah, there's nothing on that mat. All right, give me some good gold this time, game. Give me some great gold. I need those big old nuggets. Uh, I'm seeing, oh, I am seeing some nice looking sizes. It's hard to tell with the water though. Ah, uh, we got two more, so it looks like we're getting a stable two per. Oh, I think we could do bo both at once. It's just a little finicky in here, so I probably wasted a lot of time trying to get the gold, but I'm going to do one more load just to make sure. I think the more you do it, the more gold you get, because I've done this like three times now. And you're not getting as much gold, obviously, but there's still a little gold in that mat, it seems like. So if we get some more gold here, that is definitely the case, because I've already done it twice. And yes, I already see some gold. So you might want to soak those things out more than once if you're playing this game. If you do want to get all the gold out of there, that is the biggest nugget I've seen yet, I think. Please tell me we got to use the tweezers on that bad boy. Oh my god, I did it again. All right, hard to get used to, but there we go. We should just got to grab that deliciously sized nugget. Nope, still gotta use the sucker. So we're getting some pretty big nuggets here, but clearly not that big, I guess. Oh, we got the tweezers for one, finally. All right, that one didn't even look that big to me, but there we go. We finally got a decent amount. Actually, let's take that dirt out. I don't know if you need to take the dirt out, but I do like doing it, just in case. All right, so we got one more load to do, I think. And then I think we're gonna call it a day. Mind you, it's been... Almost two days of gold mining here. We did a lot today, though. We got a little bit of gold. I'm hoping we earned enough, like I said, to buy that pump. That way we can increase our output drastically at this uh, wash plant here. So let's just get that. All right, just a little one there. Let me just make sure. Always like to do a double one if you only get one nugget, just in case there's some more in that dirt. There never is, though. That one looks pretty big, though. Is that a tweezer size? No, it's not. I always think they're big. But no, they're not. All right, we're just going to get rid of that. There we go. Done that. Done that. Done that. We got 
three or point three of an ounce of gold. Not too shabby. All right, and with that in mind, I remember there's a computer in here. Maybe we can check the computer for, yeah, okay. Equipment store, Old Glen Bank workers, machine equipment store failures. Old Glen Bank, I wonder, there's definitely, I can sell gold bars, but I need to go and make gold bars. I don't think I got enough gold for a gold bar, that's for sure. Let's shut down that. Is there anything else in here that we can use? Just to be safe. Ooh. Can we melt our own? I can only assume that's... Maybe he's cooking something. I don't know, but I thought he was melting his own gold. I doubt it's that simple. All right, so there's nothing in there. It's looking like, actually, before we go, let's make sure it's morning time. I'd rather not go out in the middle of the night, so... Officially, we are on our third day. Welcome. Good morning, everybody. And, uh, yeah, what we're gonna do right now is go back to town and see if possibly, I'm assuming, the blacksmith is where we need to go. All right, so nothing like an early morning joyride to, uh, end this one off. We're just gonna go back. We get to go through these woods again, though. This is actually... The map is really impressive in this. Uh, I have been to Alaska a couple times. It looks pretty accurate to it, especially in the summertime. Uh, did we just get stuck? Uh-oh. Your differential lock. Turn turn on your differential lock. Okay. Ah, oh, that, that, that helped quite a bit. Okay. Definitely want to use the differential lock around here. And finally, we're back on flat road, at least hopefully. Yes, thank God. Now, the blacksmith should be, as actually, this is probably the sign right around here. Uh, oh, little leg. There's the blacksmith right there with a nice muscle car in the front here. All right, let's see what we can do. Maybe we can sell it. Maybe we can't. I don't... So is this the blacksmith? Please tell me this is the blacksmith. This is probably... Yeah, there we go. There's the blacksmith sign. All right, so, yes, we can sell our stuff. Please don't tell me I only earned $3. Oh, it costs $3 to smelt it. All right, melt the gold. Oh, look at it, guys. We got it. We... <laughs> We actually got a little gold bar. All right, do I actually... Oh, God. I, I thought I could maybe put this in my pocket. I guess it's too big for that. This is scaring me because I'm definitely going to lose this. You watch. All right, make sure it's in there. Let's make sure it's right in the middle because last thing I want to do is lose this. <laughs> there we go. That's a heavy load right there. All right, thank you, Mr. Blacksmith. Now, I don't want to hit your dirt bike. We're going to slowly go down the road. Maybe I should have put the gold inside here. I feel like at least I could see it then. Last thing I want to do is have to go look down the road for a gold that fell out of my truck. All right, I've come to deposit my gold. Let's see, do I have to actually hold it? Do I... Well, I don't think I need to... What, do I... what am I supposed to do with it? Just drop it at the door? Sell gold bars. Your bars. Oh, okay, I can legit... I can't sell it. I can't... Sell. Please sell. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Where's my gold bar? D did I sell it? I did sell it! I got $389! Okay, I had a little bit of a freak out there. Because it didn't really say thank you or anything. It just said okay. Well, it didn't say anything. So, now we got 389 bucks. I don't know if that's enough to buy a pump. That was the hardest $389 I've ever had to earn. But, uh, yeah, you gotta appreciate that. So, we're gonna end this episode of Gold Rush here, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Let me know what you think of this game. Because, obviously, there's lots more we can unlock and do. Definitely next time I want to buy that pump and then possibly move on to tier 2, which will be a real wash plant. So yeah, we'll wrap it up here, guys. As always, thanks for watching and liking, and I'll see you in the next one.